Our club has always strongly believed in giving back to the community with the skills we have gained from our time in robotics. In March, we organized a robotics teachers workshop to introduce our school staff about the basics of VEX robotics and by extension, some basic concepts in robotics like drive trains and lifts. With the onset of the COVID-19 pandemic, many of the workshops that we had scheduled had to be moved online. We organized online workshops to teach topics such as basic programming, CAD and 3D printing. Furthermore, we organized CAD and 3D printing workshops for our fellow students and beloved teachers. We recognized the importance and applications of STEM in today's world and hence used our new school 3D printing facilities and computer lab to host workshops to teach the basics of Fusion 360 and 3D printing, giving others the opportunity to experiment and learn and even print things for themselves and making feasible the future use of the school 3D printing facilities for personal projects. Observing general disappointment at the lack of school-wide gatherings, we committed to building the whole school campus in a rough one-to-one -one ratio in Minecraft to make such gatherings possible in a virtual setting and dispel the gradual loss of camaraderie. We used it for a multitude of applications, such as open house and also for virtual school-wide gatherings. To circumvent the common problem of masked ear loops being uncomfortable when worn for long periods of time, we made an adjustable mask ear hook for easy and comfortable mounting of masks behind the neck instead of around the ears. We distributed 170 to our school community and 40 to local hospitals to express support for the teachers and healthcare workers who had to wear masks for long periods of time. We also printed mask cages, devices to keep masks from touching the wearer's face, making it more comfortable to wear masks for longer periods of time by reducing the smother of thicker masks. We have produced 210 ear loops and 200 mask cages to date.